Out of him and push the dead. Out of him and push the dead. Diabetes come out. Insulin demons come out. Diabetes come out. Diabetes come out. Diabetes come out. Diabetes come out. Do not do that to his body. You are not allowed to do that to his body. I handcuff you right now. Okay? You now you're handcuffed. Okay? You're handcuffed. Get out of this man right now. Come in Jesus' mighty name. Toda obra de macumbaria contra a vida dessa mulher foi feita para matar ela. Toda obra que foi feita para matar ela agora está quebrada. No sangue de Jesus Cristo. Está quebrado. Está quebrado. Em nome de Jesus Cristo, sai agora. Sai demônio. 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 Hello friends, this is Brother Carlos. I'm here in my driveway now getting ready to leave, okay? Um, here's the thing, okay? This is a very important video for you. By the way, this is Brother Carlos, the man who arrests and incarcerates evil spirits, financial demons, okay? Amen? So I have, I have some really good news for you here, all right? I, I don't do this very often, and 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 what i'm gonna do now i probably won't do it again all right this is what i'm gonna do i'm going to incarcerate your financial demons those who have been robbing you and hindering money from coming to you okay regularly all right and that are evil spirits assigned by satan you know to block blessings from coming to us you know, like uh, even a huge, you know, large sum of money. You know, some people, they have inheritance that never gets to them. Some some people have lawsuits against former employers and they, they, you know, they never get anything, you know, because there are evil spirits that get in the way, okay? Some of these demons are known as poverty, evil spirits, poverty. Okay, related to money, related to finances, okay? When you read Deuteronomy chapter 28, you're going to see that there are curses and blessings, okay, for disobeying God. So that's what gives them ground to hinder blessings from coming to us is our disobedience to God. We break principles and then these evil spirits are unleashed by Satan to come our way to hinder blessings from getting to us. Amen. So this is what, this is what I'm going to do. And then that's why I'm telling you, this is a very special one. Okay. I'm going to arrest these money demons that have been robbing you. Okay. For one whole year, I'm going to incarcerate them for one whole year. Do I have authority to do that? Of course I do. Luke 10, 19. I've been doing this for 31 years, folks. I have already cast out so many demons, thousands of evil spirits. Okay. I have incarcerated evil spirits for, you know, especially for money purposes. Okay. If, if, let me put this way. If you are being hindered by evil spirits from receiving extra money, from receiving a good income, from finding a good job, from starting your own business, and perhaps even from receiving, you know, like an, an inheritance, you know, or something, whatever. If, 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 if you are one of these people, okay, then this is going to work for you because I'm going to arrest your evil spirits that are hindering you from receiving blessings. Amen? financial blessings okay amen and the like now we're gonna use i'm gonna use a, a biblical principle to do that okay the biblical principle that i'm gonna do that i'm gonna use is from luke chapter 6 verse 38 okay it's a principle it's spoken by jesus christ he said Give, and it shall be given to you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over, 
shall men put onto your bosom, for with the measure that you measure, it will be measured back to you. Okay, I'm going to ask you now, by faith, you are, not, you are under no obligation to do anything. You don't have to do anything. Okay, all right. But if you really want to, you know, see if you can benefit from this, I'm going to ask you by faith to sow, okay, to give. Luke 6, 38, okay, to, 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 to sow a seed, a financial seed into my ministry. Okay, you can do it below this video, okay, uh, in the description area right there. Okay, I'm going to ask you for to sow by faith a financial seed of $25 or more. $25 or more. You don't have to sow a huge amount of money. You know, you know just if you can sow 30, great. If you can sow 50, great. Okay, it's going to be at least $25, okay? I'm going to use this money that you're going to sow into my ministry, okay, to handcuff your evil spirits, the financial demons that have been blocking money and blessings from coming to you for one whole year, 12 months, starting from the moment that you donate, okay? And believe me, I've done this in the past, and people have received blessings, okay, upon blessings, okay? In some cases, money even came in the same day, all right? Now, here's the thing, okay? They will be handcuffed and incarcerated, the evil spirits, for one whole year, 12 months, okay? Now, whatever they were blocking from coming to you, Whatever demons were blocking from coming to you, whatever they were hindering from coming to you, okay, will come to you during this period of one year, okay, because they cannot touch, okay, uh, money. They cannot touch what is yours. They cannot touch anything that is supposed to come to you during this period, you may ask, why don't you do that for a lifetime? Well, listen, we are human beings, okay? We end up here and there sowing money into Satan's kingdom. And when we do it, we open doors for evil spirits to attack us, okay? And, and how can I say I'm going to do something for a lifetime? And then two years from now, you end up sowing money into Satan's kingdom through pornography or through a, a movie or a secular movie or a video game or whatever. And then those evil spirits will come up upon you. But for one whole year, they cannot. For one whole year, they cannot. All right? So a financial seed by faith of $25 or more below this video. And this prayer that I'm going to pray now will apply to you. Okay? Let's get started right now. If you want to sow the financial seed after the prayer is over, that's fine. Okay, after this prayer is over, after this video is over, then go ahead and do it. Okay, because you already participated of the prayer. But if you want to watch the video again, go ahead. You can even fast forward this video to the prayer. Okay, which I recommend that actually after you make the donation, if you can watch this video again, fast forward this video to the prayer so you don't have to listen to everything I said here. Amen. Are you listening to the Holy Spirit? All right. Let me go ahead now and arrest these evil spirits on your behalf, on behalf of those who are going to sow, okay, that financial seed here. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, according to Luke 10, 19, which says, I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and nothing will harm you. If we spirits, look in my eyes. If we spirits in the name of Jesus Christ. I command you now. Okay. To stay away from everyone who has sown a financial seed here for this purpose. Okay. If we spirits, I'm going to use their financial seeds as handcuffs 
to incarcerate, to arrest you and incarcerate you for one whole year. If we spirits for, from, for one whole year, you cannot touch what belongs to these people and you cannot hinder any financial blessing from coming to them, including inheritance, including uh, extra money, including uh, 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 benefits from the government, from uh, uh, organizations, anything. You are now, evil spirits, handcuffed and incarcerated for 12 months. And you cannot, for this period of time, you cannot touch anything that belongs to these people. And you cannot hinder any blessings from coming, coming to them. In Jesus' mighty name, in Jesus' mighty name, in Jesus' mighty name, and you financial demons, you poverty demons, you get out of these people and leave them alone. In Jesus' mighty name, in Jesus' mighty name, I, in Jesus' mighty name, I forbid every evil spirit from coming to these people and hindering what belongs to them okay from coming to them for this during this period of 12 months in jesus mighty name in jesus mighty name okay folks i want you to take a deep breath right now three times okay do it because some demons are going to come out of you that is not even related to finances they will come out of you right now okay come out evil spirits <sighs> come out evil spirits <sighs> Come out, evil spirits. Now, I'm going to do something else here, okay? I'm going to break curses right now, okay, on your behalf. That has nothing to do, uh, uh, have nothing to, these curses have nothing to do with the finances, but it's it's some other areas, like sexual areas, like, uh, you know, emotional areas, mental, okay? I'm going to drive these demons out from you as well, because they sometimes, you know, you know, they don't they will not hinder any blessing from coming to you but sometimes they cause you to feel depressed you know uh, uh you know sick diseased okay mentally tormented okay i'm going to cast these devils out right now and please okay focus on this prayer okay these demons are going to fly out of you right now in the name of the lord jesus christ you evil spirits financial demons Come out in Jesus' mighty name. Let me turn the phone off here. Okay. Uh, uh, there was a call coming through. I don't know if it got into the call here or not. But let me go back here. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, if we spirits, come out now, mental demons. Come out now, sexual demons. Go to the pit, depression. Come out, suicidal thoughts. Come out in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Come out now, pornography. Come out now, depression. Come out and go to the pit. Come out and go to the pit. Come out of these people right now. Leave them alone. 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 In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Come out, murder spirits. Come out, homicide. Come out, automobile accidents. Go to the pit now. In Jesus' mighty name, come out. Take a deep breath right now three times again. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, witchcraft. Come out, curses. In Jesus' mighty name, I break all witchcraft now off these people. In Jesus' mighty name. All right, say amen. You know what to do. After you make that donation, okay, I recommend, you don't, want, you don't have to do it if you watch the whole video already, but I recommend that you watch this video again and fast forward to the prayer, okay? If you, if you want to watch the whole thing again, go ahead. The more, the better. Amen? God bless you now. Let me pray a final prayer over you. And remember, your financial demons will be arrested and incarcerated for 12 months. Don't forget that, 12 months. A lot of blessings can come to you in 12 months. A lot. All right. A lot. All right. Keep that in mind. Okay. Let me just go ahead now 
and pray the final prayer. Father, I ask right now that you seal this deliverance and that you fill every empty spot vacated by unclean spirits with the presence of the Holy Spirit in everyone's bodies, minds, souls, and spirits. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Father, for blessing everyone, for blessing these people. In Jesus' mighty name. Are you listening to the Holy Spirit? All right. Amen. Say amen. Say I'm blessed. Okay. I'm going to prosper from now on. Amen. I'm going to succeed in everything I do. Amen. Say that now and say amen. Praise the Lord. Write down below in the comment area. Praise the Lord. I receive it. I'm blessed. I'm set free. Okay. I'm going to prosper like never before. All right. Write that down there. Amen. Praise God. God bless you now and have a wonderful day. Thank you, Jesus. Amen.